So what is a portrait? On the most like basic level, a portrait is meant to display a likeness, often of a person. Today, it feels like common practice to pull out our phones and snap a photo of ourselves or the things happening around us. But, but before photography, painting was one of the only ways to have a record of what someone looked like. Painted portraits were ways for people to memorialize themselves. After you've moved on, you could continue to live up on the wall forever if you were wealthy and could afford to have someone paint a portrait of you. As technology has evolved and people started exploring portraiture through photography, early photographers started creating portraits of themselves sometimes. And there are many reasons why folks might have turned the camera on themselves. Maybe it was just to test the lighting or the composition before having the actual subject come in. Or maybe it was out of convenience because they were the only one in the room. Or maybe artists are just obsessed with what they look like. There's some debate around this, but Robert Cornelius is credited as taking the first photographic self-portrait in 1839. Yeah, I want you to take in this image. What do you see? What do you know about Robert? What is he trying to tell you about himself? Was this even meant to be shown publicly or was this just something that that he was playing around with and now let's flash forward to the present day where documenting yourself is common practice is something we don't even think about and you have contemporary artists like jacoby satterwhite who's exploring self-portraiture by creating these 3D animated universes that explore queerness through movement. Or Martine Gutierrez, whose indigenous woman catalog is using her body as a satirical take on editorial and fashion magazines and advertising and femininity. or Ai Weiwei, whose work has spanned many different mediums, who also uses self-portraits on Instagram to call out the censorship of the Chinese government. Or even Kim Kardashian, whose book Selfish um, has kind of elevated the selfie into this art book object, photographs by Kim Kardashian, who arguably has more reach as an artist than any of the people I just named. <laughs> the beauty about self-portraiture is that you're in control. You get to decide when and why and explore what moves you in the moment. There's no hierarchy, just you, your body, and whatever you choose to do with it. Your task for this module is to think about a time when you laughed uncontrollably. Where were you? Who were you with? How did it feel to lose yourself in laughter? What was so funny about that moment? What was so memorable about that moment? So I want you all to take some time and kind of bring yourself into that place. Maybe you could write some notes or just reflect on your head to kind of bring those feelings to the forefront. And um, I'll see you in part three.